The handbrake we're using is the Simartec MSB Pro Plus handbrake. This is a progressive and a button mode handbrake. Our driver is currently using it in the button mode, which on Xbox uses the B button, and on a PS4, PS5 uses the circle button when you pull the handbrake. This handbrake is essentially the same as the MSB Pro handbrake. The difference is this one has two modes in it, giving you more options. In this video we are using the handbrake with the G920, but it does also work with the Logitech Pro, it works with the Thrustmaster, basically any wheel on the market it works with. Everything you need comes included, the Simartec receiver black box and the handbrake and the cables required. Our driver is now switching from button mode into progressive mode. You do this by switching a switch on the front of the MSB module, which is at the front of the handbrake, and switch it down, and then this gives you a progressive output. The progressive input on the Xbox is on the left trigger, and also on the PS4, PS5 version. On the PS5 only version, it's on the right trigger input. So this is what will show up when you map the handbrake. The black box is plugged in to the console and the handbrake is actually wirelessly connected to that black box so there's actually no wires powering that handbrake. If you look on the side you can see there's batteries and that's how it works, the free AA batteries. We use the same handbrake on all the console versions, what changes is the Simartec receiver. So if you were to have an Xbox for example and in the future you change to a PS5 then you only replace the black box, you don't replace the whole handbrake. Here you can actually see the progressive input of the handbrake. So when you have a progressive input in the handbrake, it allows you to control the car more, so if you only want to say 50% braking, you just pull the handbrake back to that amount. Whereas when you're using a button, you've got full handbrake whenever that button's on. So we've now moved over to the PS5 I'm on now. Gran Turismo 7, and all that's changed is the Simartec receiver has changed. The handbrake is the same, everything else is the same. A link to each of the versions of the handbrakes will be in the description. And if you like what we do, hit subscribe.